But 11, a bill that would strengthen renters' rights in Atlanta is a step closer to becoming law. In light of the housing crisis, one city council member said the time is now to adopt a new tenant's bill of rights to help Atlanta renters avoid homelessness. Well, this comes as landlords are charging more than ever for rent. The average one-bedroom apartment to rent in Atlanta is more than $1,800 a month. CBS 46's Patrick Quinn joins us live in the city tonight. Patrick, what new protections will renters have? Well, the biggest protection, more legal help for renters. Forget this, nationwide data shows that during eviction hearings, landlords, they have a lawyer 90% of the time. Tenants, renters, they only have a lawyer 10% of the time. This Bill of Rights would help even out that disparity, and the sponsor behind this bill also said that it would keep people from falling into homelessness. Miracle Fletcher has been homeless since January. It's a horrible feeling because you feel alone. You feel as if you're not important. The 39 year old and her two kids are now staying with friends and family. She says she's been evicted multiple times, a painful legal process, one she feels is unfair. You just feel really, really hopeless. And when you go, it's almost like um, David and Goliath. With many experts projecting a recession is on the horizon, 56% of Atlanta rents and new data shows of those renters with kids, one in five are now behind on their rent, facing homelessness. It used to be housed and unhoused, now it's about to be unhoused. One Atlanta City Council member, Byron Amos, has seen this group grow, and now he's trying to give renters facing eviction, like Miracle, more help through a tenant's bill of rights. The biggest thing is the housing crisis that the entire nation is facing, not just not the city of Atlanta. It is time, and it is time for the capital city of the state of Georgia to step up. In addition to more legal help, this legislation would install a tenant advocacy group and urge state lawmakers to consider rent control. For Miracle, who pleaded directly to the council, this Bill of Rights gives renters a fighting chance to stay off the streets. If not the city, who will make sure that the land developers, that the people that own these properties are doing right by the people that are paying their money? And Council Member Amos, he told me that he knows he could come against some pushback. He knows historically Georgia has been very friendly to property owners. He hopes this legislation encourages the state legislators this upcoming session to take into account tenants' rights. Live tonight in Atlanta, Patrick Quinn, CBS 46 News.